Hello there, this will be an optimization guide for Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Now this is mostly gonna be helpful for people with graphic cards of AMD, but you can notice improvements with Nvidia as well, it's just not gonna be as much as AMD graphic cards, since this tutorial is gonna be about using the Vulkan API instead of the DirectX 11. So now the first thing we need to do is to go to this link right here, I will leave it in the video description. This latest version might be different for you, for me it's 2.5.3. Then we go to this blue download link here, we click it once, it's going to start downloading. I'm just going to drag it to my desktop right here, after it's done downloading. Then we go to this 7-zip um, software, we download that as well. We simply install it by just double clicking on it, that's it. Close, and then we right click the archive we downloaded before from the blue link. Then extract here, it's going to give us another archive. Then we extract it as well, the same way as before. Right clicking, 7-zip, then extract here. Now we can get rid of the previous um, files and folders. We don't need those anymore. Then we open this um, last folder we have. We go to x64 and then we navigate to where the game is installed for us. For me it's going to be on C drive and this is for the Steam version. Program 86 program files 86 then steam steam apps then common and assassin's creed odyssey here so make sure to find where the game is installed for you then we drag and drop all these um, dll files after that we go to the game's executable we go to its properties compatibility make sure this checkbox is checked then we close and launch our game and if you still encounter stutters, another thing you can do is to go to the control panel of NVIDIA. But if you have AMD, make sure to find the equivalent settings for your graphics card. Then from the manage 3D settings here, we select our game. Then we scroll down until we find this latency option. Make sure to set it to ultra. After that, we can limit our FPS in game. If we constantly hit 60, we can set the limit to 60 here. But if you hit beyond that you can experiment with different numbers but for me i'll set it just to 60 then apply and that should be it i hope this helps you and peace out